Most Americans believe that the media have a liberal bias. And the Media Research Center proves it every day. The Media Research Center, America's media watchdog. Welcome to News Busted. I'm Jody Miller. Let's get started. Due to its current merger with Comcast, NBC will be changing its logo. The new logo is seen here. <laughs> a new bill is in the works that will give President Obama a kill switch on the internet. Uh-oh. Uh Looks like he's already got it. <laughs> The U.S. Treasury is keeping pressure on Congress to raise America's debt ceiling. They're asking that it be raised from a zillion cavillion dollars to a bazillion kajillion dollars. <laughs> Five Democrat lawmakers in Hawaii support a law making President Obama's birth certificate public. Oh, hold on. This just in. Five Democrat lawmakers in Hawaii are now officially racist. <laughs> Congressional Democrats want to fund high-speed trains. If built, the trains could quickly transport hundreds of defeated Democrats out of Washington in 2012. <laughs> According to a recent study, some credit cards now have an interest rate of up to 60%, which is almost as costly as the credit card America is using to run up its deficit. <laughs> The new poll shows that 66% of Americans are angry at the television news media. Of course, this means the other 34% obviously aren't watching. <laughs> and finally, a man just spent $175,000 on a replica of Carrie Bradshaw's Sex in the City fantasy walk-in closet. And while the man's name hasn't been released, let's just say it rhymes with Ganderson Hooper. <laughs> Thanks for watching News Busted, everybody. I'm Jody Miller. Please text Newsbusters to 85944 and make a $10 donation to help keep News Busted going strong in 2011. Be sure to subscribe to our videos. We'll catch you next time.